Brian Cranston's crime drama, Your Honor, abruptly ended in March 2023, after only two seasons, leaving many wondering why a third season never came to fruition. Based on the Israeli series Kuvodo, Your Honor stars Brian Cranston as Michael Desiato, a New Orleans judge whose teenage son, Adam Desiato, Hunter Dohan, accidentally kills another teenage boy in a hit and run. When Michael finds out that the victim is the son of mob kingpin Jimmy Baxter, Michael Stuhlbarg, he uses his connections to cover up Adam's crime, which only pulls them both deeper into the mess. Your Honor Season 1 premiered on Showtime on December 6, 2020, airing new episodes weekly until the series finale on February 14, 2021. Your Honor Season 2 arrived a little under two years later, premiering on January 15, 2023, and concluding on March 19, 2023. However, a third season of Your Honor never followed, raising questions about whether the series was cancelled, and if not, why it ended. The primary reason that Your Honor never made it to season three is that it wasn't intended to be a multi-season show in the first place. When the series was adapted for American television by Peter Moffat, Your Honor was initially conceived of, written, and produced in a limited series format. What would go on to become season one was supposed to be the beginning and end of the story, with no intention of continuing on after the finale. Considering it was never expected to go past season one to begin with, there was no expectation that Your Honor would go past season two, so it was hardly a shock that a third season wasn't announced after season two concluded. According to Cranston, who is also an executive producer on the series, Showtime decided to renew Your Honor for a second season because of season one's exceptionally high rating. However, he only agreed to return if season two properly explored his character's grief after his son's death in the season one finale. If this really happened and you lost a child, it changes your life forever, Cranston explained on Dak Shepard's Armchair Expert podcast ahead of the season two premiere in 2022. So if you really want to show a man in abject despair, if there is any possibility of a life beyond that, let's do it. But it has to be incrementally discovered. During this 2022 appearance, before season two had even premiered, Cranston confirmed that this would be the final season of Your Honor. Considering it was never expected to go past season one to begin with, there was no expectation that Your Honor would even go past season two, so it was hardly a shock that a third season wasn't announced even after season two concluded. Another factor that contributed to Your Honor's lack of a third season is the lower ratings in season two. Your Honor season one averaged approximately 590,500 viewers per episode each week, zero. 81 Nielsen rating, while season 2 only averaged 510,000 weekly viewers, 0. 49 Nielsen rating, via Showbuzz Daily. It wasn't a huge drop, but the decrease in viewership was enough to indicate a decrease in interest. When the ratings dropped in season 2, it only further confirmed that not pursuing a third season was the right call. Since there was never supposed to be a second season in the first place, it was already unlikely that Showtime was going to renew Your Honor for yet another season, regardless of how season two performed. Thus, when the ratings dropped in season two, it only further confirmed that not pursuing a third season was the right call. Had the ratings for season two been as good or even higher than season one, it's possible that Showtime would have tried to order another season, but this is still a long shot given its initial conception as a miniseries. A month after the season two finale of Your Honor aired in March 2023, Cranston clarified his initial comments on Armchair Expert the year prior, in which he seemingly ruled out a third season. There is some discussion, he told Deadline. Showtime has indicated there is interest. What he meant was that he was unsure if there feasibly could be, or rather should be another season of Your Honor, because of how the story ended. If it happens, fantastic, he noted, but it'd have to be some great reason to keep expanding in this world. Given Cranston's Your Honor character's fate in the season two finale, though the actor didn't see himself reprising his role either way. I don't know about being in it because my guy's back in prison, Cranston explained. Although he wasn't so sure about the plausibility of returning to the screen as Michael Diziato, Cranston was still interested in producing Your Honor Season 3, if it ever came to fruition. Of course, that day never came. 
but Cranston seems more content with the series being over for good. Your Honor is an intense drama that delves into the complexities of morality, justice, and familial loyalty. The show's narrative structure is tightly woven around the catastrophic consequences of a single mistake, a hit-and-run accident that sets off a chain reaction of events leading to moral decay and violence. Brian Cranston's portrayal of Michael Desiato is central to the story showcasing a man who sacrifices his moral compass in a desperate attempt to protect his son. The series paints a grim picture of the judicial system and the lengths to which individuals will go to protect their loved ones, even if it means bending or breaking the law. The dark and morally ambiguous world of your honor aligns with the increasing popularity of anti-hero narratives in television, where protagonists are deeply flawed and their actions are often ethically questionable. This thematic depth, combined with Cranston's powerful performance, was a significant factor in the show's initial success. Transitioning a series originally intended as a limited series into a multi-season narrative poses several challenges. The primary issue is sustaining the story's momentum and relevance without diluting its core themes. For your honor, the first season's plot was designed to be self-contained, providing a complete and compelling story arc that reached a natural conclusion. When Showtime decided to extend Your Honor into a second season, it required the creators to craft a new storyline that could logically follow the intense and conclusive events of season one. This task was compounded by the need to maintain the same level of tension and moral complexity that had initially captivated audiences. The decision to explore Michael Desiato's grief and the ongoing fallout from the first season's events allowed for a continuation that felt justified, but also risked repeating similar themes and conflicts. Fewer fatigue is a common challenge for television series, especially those with intense and emotionally draining storylines like Your Honor. The drop in viewership from season one to season two suggests that some audiences might have felt the story had already reached its peak, with less incentive to continue watching beyond the initial conclusion. Furthermore, maintaining narrative continuity while introducing fresh elements is a delicate balance. Season 2 had to navigate the aftermath of Adam's death and Michael's subsequent imprisonment, exploring new dimensions of despair and guilt. While this approach provided additional depth to Cranston's character, it also risked alienating viewers who were more invested in the high-stakes tension of the first season's premise. Brian Cranston's involvement in Your Honor was undoubtedly a major draw for the series. His previous work on Breaking Bad set a high bar for his performances and his portrayal of Michael Desiato was anticipated to be similarly compelling. While Cranston delivered a nuanced and powerful performance, the weight of audience expectations based on his iconic role as Walter White may have contributed to mixed reactions regarding the continuation of Your Honor. Audience expectations can significantly influence the perception of a series' progression. For Your Honor, the intense and tightly wound narrative of the first season set a high standard that the second season had to meet or exceed. This pressure can sometimes lead to creative decisions that, while aiming to satisfy viewer demands, may not always align with the natural development of the story. Ultimately, the decision against pursuing a third season of Your Honor was influenced by a combination of factors. The show's original conception is a limited series. The narrative challenges of extending the story, the decrease in viewership and the evolving landscape of television content where audience engagement and ratings are critical. Brian Cranston's comments about the possibility of a third season reflect a pragmatic approach to storytelling. While there was some interest from Showtime, the necessity of a compelling and justified continuation was paramount. Cranston's willingness to potentially produce but not star in a third season underscores his commitment to the integrity of the narrative and his character's art. Despite not extending beyond two seasons, Your Honor leaves behind a significant legacy. The series tackled complex themes of justice, morality, and familial loyalty, all while delivering intense drama and powerful performances. Brian Cranston's portrayal of Michael Desiato added another layer of depth to his already impressive body of work and the show's exploration of the consequences of desperate actions resonated with many viewers. In the realm of crime dramas, Your Honor stands out for its moral complexity and the ethical dilemmas faced by its characters. 
The series prompts viewers to question the boundaries of right and wrong and the extent to which one might go to protect their family. These themes, coupled with the show's high production values and strong performances, ensure that Your Honor will be remembered as a thought-provoking and emotionally charged narrative. Your Honor was a compelling and intense drama that captivated audiences with its morally complex story and powerful performances, particularly by Brian Cranston. While the series ended after two seasons, the decision not to pursue a third season was influenced by its original conception as a limited series, challenges in extending the narrative, lower ratings in the second season, and pragmatic considerations about the story's natural conclusion. The legacy of Your Honor lies in its exploration of justice, morality, and the lengths to which people will go to protect their loved ones. The series remains a notable entry in the crime drama genre, remembered for its thought-provoking themes and the impressive performance of its lead actor. Despite the absence of a third season, Your Honor succeeded in delivering a complete and impactful story that resonated with its audience.